Okay, everyone, since uh, the stream was like, I was trying to test the stream, so that's why I um, didn't see the gameplay of the first couple of ones. But it's normal, the first couple of missions stay the same. Um, okay, everyone, since uh, the so stream was like, I was trying to test the stream, so that's why. <laughs> Normal, the first couple missions stay the same. Um, okay, everyone, say okay, uh, this stream is really useful. There's no telling what the Zerg will throw against us this time. Uh, sorry about the background. We were discussing this Just for the past couple of days. Um, no point upgrading it right now. Upgrade. Especially if you play Boodle, you may want this, but there's no point. Your base defense at this moment you are not depend on which one you're taking. Um I most at this moment I'm gonna just save up and just go a bunch of ways. What's our general status, Matt? We've picked up a distress call from the planet Agria. There's a colony there under attack by the Zerg. Your convict buddy Tychus lined up a mission retrieving another artifact. It's on a Protoss shrine world called Monolith. Uh, you have two choices. You want to, you can get fired back. Any ship receiving this transmission. Or you want to fire The lobby is. Um, you pay. Basically, if you're making things, you may want your Marauders, especially if it'll help a lot. Once you get the Marauder, you grab their banks. The money is not bad here. You can do it. So. The Mobius boys think there's another artifact in a world called Monlith. Supposedly, there's Protoss guarding it. A group of fanatics call themselves the Taldarim. Now, don't get all sentimental thinking these Taldarim are your old Protoss buddies. Because they ain't. Um, if you choose to do this mission and you're doing Brutal, you will want Marauders because they have Vultures. And your fire bat and your Marine gets smoked by them, so there's no point. Recommendation is always do the Marauder ones. Um, I don't know why, but like Marauder, it will help you slow down a lot of stuff. Keep your enemy intact where you want, so they don't run away or chase you after you need to run away. Uh, on your attack ground, you don't need to fire back. There's no point upgrading anyway, so you want, definitely want the Marauder. There it is, Jimmy. Just like Mobius said. Easy money. I don't know. There's a lot of Protoss down there. We're gonna have to... What the? Warning. Multiple Zerg biosignatures detected. Ah, hell. Them critters were just hiding underground, waiting? No idea, but you can bet they're headed straight for our shrine. Well, that show complicates things. We can't fight two armies at once, partner. With any luck, we won't have to. We only need to hold the area at the top of the shrine long enough to extract the artifact. So we'll land here, and cut our way through the Protoss lines while they're busy with the Zerg. It's only a matter of time before the Zerg overwhelm the Protoss. We'd best grab the artifact, and be long gone by then. I'm paying this to the Harvest Army Marines through the normal, because I just want to go through it to recap the storyline. But definitely, when we play Legacy of the Fort, definitely I'm going to do it on Brutal, because I read Brutal on all missions and you raise no point. Something we just do. We do the story again. I'm gonna see if I can stream for YouTube. Um, which I'm trying to see right now. Uh, you. 